Brooklyn Center teens will soon have a new hangout closer to home. Hello everyone and thanks for joining us. I'm Mike Johnson. And I'm Alexandra Renslow. Brooklyn Center and the Brooklyn Center School District are close to opening a new recreation center next to the high school. As Renee Bonneau reports, it'll be the first facility of its kind in the city. Just a month after moving here from Kentucky, Devontae Roberts has already found a home away from home at Zanewood Recreation Center in Brooklyn Park. I've been chilling, playing basketball, meeting new friends. And Roberts and other teens who come here on a regular basis say hanging out here beats the alternative. So kids aren't on the street and doing dangerous stuff like drugs or in gangs. It's this type of teen hangout that neighbors in Brooklyn Center are sorely lacking until this fall. I'd love to have it so that on a weekend, it's a rainy day and, and there's nothing else scheduled and kids just need some place to go and run off some steam, come on over. To Keith Lester, this 6,000 square foot white walled room is the answer to teenage boredom in Brooklyn Center. If there's a youth recreation sport that can be done in here, it will. This will soon be home to the Brooklyn Center Youth Recreation Center, a spot that'll hold open gym and other non-school related activities. The school district has partnered with the city to build and run the facility. They used a $304,000 youth recreation grant from Hennepin County to build the structure and will need about $50,000 more to pay for add-ons like bathrooms and sports equipment. It is the Zanewood of, of Brooklyn Center in the sense that the reason and the purpose and the use of Zanewood is for youth activities that aren't going on in schools and that's what this is. The district in the city will rely on capital bond money and the donations to pay for some of the extras that will go into the facility. Keith Lester is especially hoping donors will come forward to help pay for multi-purpose flooring. But even without a floor in place, Mike and Alex, he says the building should be open to the public for limited use in the next few weeks. All right, thank you. Should be a good thing.